Anglican Communion Ministers, Christian Faithful, alongside family and friends of the Bishop of Akure Diocese and Archbishop Ondo Ecclesiastical Province, the Most Reverend Simeon Borokini rolled out the drums in appreciation to God for yet another year of fulfillment. <laughs> In his sermon, Venerable Dr. Stephen Fagbemi lauded Archbishop Borokini for putting in his best towards expanding the kingdom of God, encouraging him to do more and make the diocese of Akure an enviable denomination in Christendom. What the Lord said I should say unto you, my father, is that in paying attention to legacy, you must consider three areas. Number one is infrastructure. Number two is institution. And number three is individual. The celebrants and family testified to the glory of God for his benevolent grace over the years. At this time when everything is very tough, we need to move closer to him and call upon him. And also continue to pray. The church will continue to pray for our leaders so that God will touch their hearts to lead us directly. We remarked on the, the exponential increase of churches and parishes under his leadership. 11 Ajikiris when he resumed 11 years ago, now 22, doubling what has been. Uh, and the preacher also did say that uh, what the Dalsis achieved in 30 years, uh, Baba was able to achieve more in 10 years. I would pray that it can only get better. It's the work of the Lord and may the Lord continue to renew their strength. God has been very faithful to us in our family. Last year was very tough. My husband was ill, but God saved him. And I thank God Almighty that he's hell and heart now and we are still working for God. And we will continue to work for God till the end of our life. Wife of the clergyman, Mrs. Christiana Borokini, also referred to as Mama Kure gave out 20,000 naira each to selected widows as a way of empowering them. High point of the event was the dedication of an ultra modern church building, Holy Trinity Anglican, erected in Ukearu, Akure. <laughs> The minister in charge of the church, Venerable Timothy Akinobi, returned glory unto God for successful completion of the project despite paucity of funds. Baba has been a father to every priest in our prayer houses. When we have a problem, we run to him. Uh, when we are building for God here, we face a lot of challenges, honestly speaking. Financially, when he came here last, he gave us 250000 huge amount of money. And it's, when I want to go out to go and mobilize people, I discussed with him and he said, okay, go, you have my blessing. And even before I got, got there, Baba will make sure that he called the person to plead on my behalf. So and all the money are not going to his pocket. The church building project, which commenced in 2016, was estimated at 57 million naira. Omori Olahunwiji, OSRC News.